I would like you to join me with three deep breaths to center your attention to this video. My name is Nicholas Lamore, and let's just get right into it. Being fat sucks. I was fat. I was 258 pounds a year and a half ago. It sucks. I didn't recognize it in the moment. You don't recognize it in the moment, but you're fat. And if you clicked on this video because you think you're fat, you're fat. And it's harsh to recognize, but you are. And I don't think that you're living until you're semi, maybe a little bit chubby, maybe not fat at all. You know what not fat is. That's not, I'm not here to tell you that. But in my opinion, I was not living until I became fit or losing that pounds to where I wasn't over 230 or, or 220 or maybe down to 210. But that's my body type, you know? I really feel like I was not living. And that's what you don't get as a fat person. You think, oh, like I'm going to be fat forever, blah, 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 blah. blah life of a skinny person I can speak for that because I was obese and I was fat and my life now is insane it's like it's it's insane how happy you're gonna be with yourself after you do this and it's all in the mind it is all in the mind everyone thinks it's a physical thing a physical thing to get out and run and, and go to the gym and then bench and, and squat and, and all that and get exercise or do yoga or any of that no it's all in your mind. And this is how you're gonna start to change your life forever. Forever. I know you don't like being fat. I know you don't. If this was a message to my past self, this is me yelling at myself. You're not, you're not living. Like, get yourself together, bro. Stop eating junk food that makes you feel like crap. Stop doing stuff that makes you feel like crap. Eating brownies, there's nothing fulfilling about that. Because because right after you finish that brownie, all that guilt is in you, inside you, and it's gonna hold down. And it's gonna, it's just gonna cause depression and sadness. Junk food doesn't make you feel good. It tastes so good in your mouth, but when it comes down and it goes in here, to forget about it. It's 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 pathetic. It's not good. It's junk food. It's not it's not gonna make you feel good. Nutrition is everything. What you eat is what you become. Let food be thy medicine. And this medication. Will cure your obese or fatness. 100%. It's not fun being fat. I can't stress that enough. So how do we start? Um, I didn't start with this, but it would have been the most efficient way for me to become what I desire. And that's the whole thing. You have to have a desire for your mind to attach onto. So you have to say right now, right now, say to yourself, I'm done with this shit. I'm done. I'm eating healthy. I'm exercising. Even if I do one push up a day, that's better than nothing. Even if I don't eat that brownie or that cookie, or even if I eat half of it, like, sorry, I'm losing my attention. Even if you eat semi healthy food you're still making a difference every single step a, the tiny difference you think tiny 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 differences in your lifestyle don't change yes they do so do a do five push-ups right like right after this video do five sit-ups right after this video it's a start it's a start you need to start somewhere and i recommend 100 percent meditation because it's all in your mind and meditation is a practice it's hard i challenge you to a five-day medit or a week meditation of five minutes and have the intention of meditating and exercising and eating healthy your life will change forever because after this week is over you're gonna see results your stomach you're like holy crap you're gonna wake up there like, holy crap like all this belly fat like it's going down and you're gonna be like holy crap it's working but that's where the most important part comes in consistency you have to be consistent it doesn't matter if you go to the gym for 10 minutes just go or just do something like it's, it's it's a work in progress. Everyone thinks that it's like you have to be on the strict, like you have to be strict as hell with it, and you have to you have to 
you have to continue and, and you have to do hour of day at the gym and grind and grind. No, nah, it's an ongoing cycle. How many years left do you like you got? I'm 18. I mean, who knows? The 70 years? I got. If you're fat right now, you got 70 years to become not fat. Be patient. Don't rush yourself. It's going to happen. And coming from me, I'll show you the pictures in the thumbnail and what I look like now. It's just a matter of time until you realize that it will happen if you put your mind to it. So get off your ass, exercise, and start eating healthy, and meditate. Because it's all up here. And until your mind says, I can do this, you're not going to change. Say that, I'll say that again. Until your mind says, I can do this, it's not going to change. Now with some harsh motivation, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, we just hit 100 subscribers, so that's cool. I mean, we James and I enjoy this YouTube channel just as much as we did when both of our moms subscribed, and then my sister, and then my dad. Now you guys are here with us, so that's amazing. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Peace out.